Hi, it's Paul here from Merchant Spring. We've made some really great enhancements to our sales by group functionality. And if you are an agency or a distributor or even an aggregator that has a need to report on individual brands that are perhaps managed through the same selling account or the same vendor account, uh, this is some great functionality for you. Let me take you through the quick highlights here. All right, so I'm just in one of our demo stores here and I am at the sales by group report or functionality. This has existed for a while, but the key change we've made, in fact, we've made two are as follows. The first change here is that for some of these groups, you'll now start to see a little icon here, a yellow icon, very small. But what that means is that this group is now automatically linked to a filtered store. So we've always used groups as the basis for creating a filtered stores but we're now maintaining that link. What that means is if you add an ASIN or a SKU to that custom group, that SKU is then automatically added to the filtered channel as well. So no need to recreate that channel and do that again. The second item that we've added here is when you create a group, we've given you another option. We've always had the option of uh, selecting individual ASINs. You can do this through manual input here, but you can also do that via the CSV upload. But there's a second option now, which is create a custom group based on brands. So instead of choosing individual products, you just tell us what is the brand on which you want to base this custom group or perhaps multiple brands that belong to the same client. Um, you can simply select these, give the group a name and save it in the same way that you've created custom groups before. Uh, what's different though is that this list is not static. So what we do is every four hours, we check the Amazon or Walmart or other marketplace catalog to see if there are any new listings that have appeared that share those brand attributes. If there are, we will automatically include them in your custom group. And if your custom group is also dynamically linked to a filtered channel, then that will update also. It's not real time. It might take 24 hours for the filtered channel to be updated, but it will update. So if you are reporting on those numbers back to a particular client or brand, rest assured, all will be kept up to date automatically, saving you a lot of time, energy, and effort. I hope that makes sense. Of course, if anything is unclear or you want to see a short demo, just get in touch with our client success managers and they'll be happy to walk you through it. All right, take care and thanks for watching.